a little tip of breaking news. The nominees list for the Best Actress category of the 58th Bexong Awards is making many fans surprised. Will Kim Terry is likely to win? We'll see. Bexong Arts Awards is one of the most prestigious and incredible awards in Korean film industry has finally released nominations for the upcoming awards ceremony this year. In the past years, we have witnessed many comebacks of famous superstars who are at the forefront of the Hollywood wave. Famous names like Song Hye Kyu, Son Ye Jin, Jung Ye Yoon, Lee Young A, Gu Yun Chung, Park Min Yang, and etc. all appeared on screen in turn, which we hardly saw in previous years. However, it seems like the personal reputations has not been able to exert its full effect in the past years. Baek Seng's Best Actress nominations this year include five names Kim Tae-ri of 2521, Kim Yesu of Jovenel Justice, Park Hyun bin of The King's Affection, Lee Sae Young of The Red Sleeve, and Han So-hee of My Name. All five of these names are quite familiar to the audience for their works in the previous years. However, many still feel quite surprised at some names in the list and think other names that should be there. Kim Terry and Lee Sae Young are two names that were predicted by many to be nominated at this year's award ceremony for their excellent performance in the dramas. Kim Terry showed viewers the solidity of a real actress. She can perfectly portray the role of an 18-year-old girl from her appearance to her mind, emotions, growth, maturity, love, and the way to overcome difficulties even though Kim Terry is 32 years old in real life. Meanwhile, Lee Se-young, although acting is a historical drama that is centered on the male lead, thanks to her experience acting, she has made the female lead character not inferior to the male lead. She succeeded of showing emotions like crying, laughing, suffering, and etc. Lee Se-young's role as a court lady really makes the red sleeve softer and more attractive. Not only does she shines for herself, she also beautifies Lee jun hoos character. Many consider Kim Terry and Lee Se young to be the two strongest candidates to win this year's award. In all aspects, these two performances are the most impressive. The dramas are also approximate in terms of content and reputations. And of course, whoever wins the award deserves it. Do you think Kim Terry and Lee Se young deserve it? Well, let me know in your comment. Anyways, we'll just have to wait who will win. Let's find out on May 6, 7.45 p.m. Korean Standard Time. Be updated in the K-pop news here in Balitang K-pop.